Whilst the cathedral city of Chichester is the main draw to this part of West Sussex, a few miles to the east is Boxgrove Priory and Hanukkah Mill, which will provide a pleasant but quieter afternoon. Boxgrove is within shouting distance of the A27 highway, and there is convenient parking at the Priory, but the entrance from the by-road is not clear. You might pass it. Founded in the 12th century, it is part ruin and a working church, and has lost much of its original nave, and you can see that from the photograph. You enter at the crossing, the chancel built in the early 13th century, now serving as the nave. I find the old and new a pleasing mix for photography. It was a lovely sunny day. The sky was enhanced by dramatic clouds. Inside the Priory I had the best of both worlds. Now, for the big shop down the nave, I waited for the sun to go behind a cloud to reduce contrast, but then later took full advantage of sunlight streaming through stained glass. This produced an image of such a high dynamic range that no camera as yet could handle. Salvation came in post-production with Adobe Lightroom, which I prefer to HDR because it is easier to backtrack if things don't work out as expected. Before leaving, we explored the ruins, making use of the sky as much as possible. It is possible to walk to Hanukkah, but feeling lazy, we drove the short distance instead. Over the years, this short walk to the windmill has become popular. An official car park adjacent to the road has been created for a limited number of cars. We were lucky. Hanukkah Mill is less than a mile from the car park, and the incline is modest. This is because the early part of the walk follows Stain Street, a Roman road that went from Chichester to London. The route is fascinating as it passes first through a tree tunnel. Halfway, our path leaves Stain Street heading for the windmill that soon comes into view. As height is gained, don't forget to look back. A magnificent view despite prominent electricity pylons and he goes back to the coast at Bognor Regis. You might just make out Butlins. It is regrettable that several years ago, Hanukkah Mill was vandalized, its sails destroyed. They have been replaced, but on our visit, they were undergoing further work and therefore removed. I have known this mill for many years and for comparison, here are a couple of shots taken in 2007. Return to your car the same way, but keep an eye open to the west for Chichester, here effectively framed by trees with a gap in the right place. At the tree tunnel, some walkers added the right amount of interest, giving scale to the composition. <laughs> 